Dude, freaking bug. It's a fake one. Don't need to be scared. Oh, got, gotcha. Got to be faster with that camera, man. Come on. All right, guys, so Modern Airsoft has a sale going on right now for their mystery boxes. It is a super cool deal, and it goes to people who really need it. They're hoping to feed 2,000 homeless veterans this year. Last year, they fed about 1,000. We are gotta we, we gotta help them out. We gotta make that happen. Go buy their mystery boxes. Their value ranges from $175 all the way up to almost $2,500. You get a gun in the box guaranteed all the way up to a possibility of five guns and gifts inside these boxes, guys. Go check out modernairsoft.com right now. They're on sale. Go pick one up and go help feed some homeless veterans, boys. All right, guys, how's it going? Uh, today is a little bit different of a video. What we're going to do here is we're going to uh, talk about some guns and stuff because I, I get a lot of questions, and number one question I get is, Dane, how do you... I was going to come up with a stupid... Hey, they always ask me, what's the best type of sniper to get? And a lot of the questions go from, should you get a spring gun or a gas sniper? And I'm here to answer this question. So I'm going to give you guys some knowledge, and then we're going to compare two uh, identical guns, but one of them's gas and one of them's spring. So we're going to learn a lot about guns. I hope the microphone picked that up. That's going to sound pretty cool. All right, so right here on the table, I got myself two guns. One of these is gas. This one's an HPA gun. This is my VSR-10. I've had it for forever. And then this is the Spring Novartis SSG-24. So a little bit of the uh, positives and negatives of both of these. This isn't going to be a fun video, by the way. This is a knowledge video. If you're here to get big brain, you came to the right place. If you came to laugh, don't. And you're not, and I won't, won't make you. So, spring, what's good about it? It's consistent. All the shots are gonna have basically the same FPS, and uh, it's, it's reasonably quiet uh, if you get, get a good enough system. With the suppressor on the end here, this gun isn't actually that loud at all. So, that's why I prefer spring personally, but when you have an HPA system or a gas sniper here, you have a lot more options for fiddling around with different settings. So for example, I made a reloading system that reloads the gun every time I press this little trigger here. So this, this allows you to shoot a lot quicker. So I, I can just go shoot, shoot, shoot. It's very quick, very fast. Um, but there's a slight inconsistency with your FPS. And also, if you have a gun that's uh, not HPA'd, but uses green gas, you're gonna have a lot of fluctuation with temperature, uh, FPS at the start and the end of the magazine um, and just in general weights of BBs are going to be affected a lot more than if it was a spring gun. Um, so that's that's why I prefer spring. Now what we're going to do here is I'm going to pull out two guns. Uh, this first gun is from G&G. &G. I got this gun a little while ago. It's the M1903. This is a green gas powered sniper rifle. So it uses a magazine here that you load up with green gas and BBs. And uh, that's, that's the way it shoots. It, the BBs come out of the gun after you cock it. It's loaded all from the magazine. Uh, and then I also have this from Swit Airsoft they sent on over. It is a M1903 as well, but this one is spring. So this one loads with a magazine that goes in realistically, which is kind of cool. And you load it into a magazine like that. So let's talk about some positives and negatives about these two guns here. So spring, again, super consistent. Uh, but it's got a little bit hard of a uh, of a bolt pull. You got to you got to really work at it a little bit uh, to get it cocked. But uh, once you practice it, you're not even going to notice it. And then the gas guns are super easy to cock. Um, and with gas, you don't really have to worry about you know pulling the bolt really hard because it's a gas system. You don't even you don't even have to worry about it. So now let's talk about uh, some shooting here. Let's get a couple shots and be putting some shots down range, shall we? All right guys, so I'm uh, using the spring version right now and I want you guys to pay attention to the sound, the speed that I can shoot at, and uh, just, just, pay, just pay attention. I'm going to put four rounds down range here just as fast as I can, and you can tell that my opinion is, is positive because I'm a professional sniper. I've played multiple video games, including Roblox and Minecraft, and I know how to shoot a gun. All right, so let's do this. We're going to do four rounds as quick as I can and uh, see, see how it feels, see how it looks, see how it smells, see how it tastes. So that, that was four pretty pretty saucy rounds. Um, you can see it's a little bit loud, but at the same time, it feels smooth and it looks great. Let's try out the gas one and see how she goes. All 
All right, so we got the gas version now. This is the G&G &G M1903. Um, you guys are gonna notice that the sound of the shot is gonna be a lot quieter, but the racking and stuff is gonna be a little bit louder just because it's metal banging on metal. So, I mean, if I were in a situation where I wanted to be silent, this is probably the better option. I could just move it a lot slower and it would be very quiet. But uh, also because of the inconsistency, I would probably go for a spring rifle over this thing. But let's do four rounds, see how it goes. Four rounds, nice and easy. Um, I really like this gun, actually, because it's all wood. I mean, both of them are all wood, but they're, they're both just sexual guns. Let's go back over the table and wrap this up. He's also blind firing. Oh, he is too. Oh my goodness. You just hit him. Did you see that? You just hit him. Got him again. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright guys, so we sort of looked over some of these really quick here. I don't have a huge range in my backyard here, so I can't really show you guys consistency, or I can show you consistency, but not really accuracy at range. Um, so I'm going to save that for doing an actual gameplay, but I wanted to give you guys a chance to sort of see what I'm going to be coming out with later on this week. I'm going to do a gameplay with this this weekend, and it's going to be super hot. Hello, airplane. Thanks for coming overhead, Ray, and some filming, buddy. So, where was I? I don't even remember. I don't even know, dude. I don't even know. Something good gameplay, guns, gameplay. good ge gameplay next week, this weekend. I'm going to record it, get it out for you next week. But I wanted to give you an idea of what I'm doing. So let's go over the list here of pros and cons, or vice versa, depending on if I switch it around. Gas guns, pros, quiet, all right? And they look sexy and they're more realistic. Cons, inconsistent. They don't really have the exact, I mean, I guess technically they have the same range because you're applying the same force to the BB. It carries the same kinetic energy. So range is fine, but consistency and accuracy is not 10 out of 10. Spring guns, very consistent. FPS is very consistent, accurate, but they're a little bit louder and uh, it's harder to pull that bolt. So if you're not used to using a bolt action rifle, it's gonna wear on you for the whole day. I am a very strong man. You can see I have one muscle right there and that is a muscle to pull the bolt of a gun. So <laughs> um, yeah, it's, it's, they're both, they're both good guns. You're going to have a fantastic time to, either way if you're using gas or spring. But if I were you, if I were a sniper, I am, I'm continuing to be a sniper. I would go for a spring. Get, buy a spring gun is what I'm trying to say. This entire video has been me trying to formulate the sentence buy a spring gun. Go get it. Now for chest SG24, fantastic gun. This gun by Swit Airsoft, the M1903, uh, also a very sexy gun. Ch link in the description, check them out.